Hello everyone. In this short video, I'm going to show a few Vim motions uh, that uh, are not available in Visual Studio Code, and I think they will make they make my life a lot easier. So I'm going to start Vim without any configuration. This is the command that I use to. Uh, you can use this command if you want to load Vim without any configuration, just as it is was the first time you open it. Also, everything that I write will be will be shown uh, in the screen, so you can follow along. I'm going to open a file that I have. It's a JavaScript file. And after it's opened, I'm going to just set syntax highlighting, so I, the code is more readable. I'm going to write this command syntax on. Okay. So the first thing that I want to show that is not available in Visual Studio Code is paragraph motion. So I want to move by a paragraph. A paragraph in Vim is a collection of lines with no empty lines between them so I can uh, and I can use I can use this curly braces closing curly braces will jump forward a paragraph and opening a curly braces will jump backwards a paragraph this is really useful and you, I can combine this with a verb so I can say while I'm inside this paragraph I can say delete inside paragraph and you can see that the paragraph is gone I can also do yank inside paragraph. Yank is the uh, equivalent for copy, and after yank it, I can paste it with B. So this paragraph motion is really useful, and it makes navigating code a lot easier, and it's not available in VS Code. Another thing is, uh, I, if I want to change uh, the word, for example, uh, react here, that I highlighted. If I want to change this while I am at the beginning, of the line uh, in, in VS Code I would have to move my cursor so I would keep like going next next keep hitting it or just use my mouse and click it but in Vim you can simply uh, say change inside single quotes and now your cursor jumps to this place and you can start writing the new words that you want to write notice that you don't have to be in inside the, the word that you want to change you can be anywhere in this line and if you just write change inside single quotes, your cursor will jump directly to it and you can start writing. Um, and also this works for uh, double quotes, it doesn't have to be single quotes, it can be double quotes. So I can say change inside double quotes and my, my cursor will jump inside it and I can write. Mm, you can also do it uh, with curly braces or any other kind of braces. So I can say change inside uh, curly braces and I can start writing and it will position my cursor, it will change the code the word inside these curly braces. <clears throat> this also works for if I want to go to this return and I want to just remove all the all the code inside this return statement, I can say delete inside parentheses and all the code inside the parentheses are gone. And this also works for tags. So here we have a text tag. This is the opening text tag. This is a closing text tag. And if I want to change whatever inside it, I can say change inside tag. And it will position my cursor inside that tag and I will start writing. Notice that all this functionality is right out of the box. I didn't need to install any plugins or anything. This comes from Vim. These are all things just are natural to Vim and there, are, there is no equivalent to them in VS Code without, without installing plugins. Mm, yeah, this is it for this video. Maybe in other videos I will explain more. Um, please, if you like this video, give it a like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.